Martin. Where are you? You're late. What happened? Are you all right? What? This morning, the explosion at Alice. Look, just get a move on, will you? I got me in at three. Where are you? Sorry? Your notebook. Don't worry, I'll bring it tomorrow. Who is this? Who do you think? It's Jerry. Jerry? What's wrong? Is someone there? Look, um, this isn't a good time, okay? I'm, I'm sorry. Colin. I have to go. Wait. I'm sorry. Bye. Martin. I hope they're still serving. Oh, what's going on? What do you mean? This morning, we were at the accelerator. There was a flash. And I woke up in a strange house. There was this woman there. And well, everything's been weird ever since. You look terrible, mate. Everything all right? No, it's not. That's what I'm trying to tell you. What day is it? Tuesday. The 3rd? Yeah. 2006. You got book signing or something? You and Ottilie have been fighting. Ottilie? Your wife, Colin. Remember her? You need to take it easy, mate. You're pushing it too hard. As soon as this launch is over, you should take a break. Just the two of you. Sort everything out. Colin? Lunch? Uh, there's some... I'll call you later. Anything. I'm not interested. I don't understand. You're in my house. No, please. We've lived here for ten years. You've got the wrong door. What? I'm telling you, 24 Hayfield Road, this is my house. If you bang on my door once more, I'm calling the police.
What are you doing out here? Um, I'll be up in a minute. You don't believe me, of course. Why should you? No one does. Well, you have to admit it's pretty far-fetched. It's all true, I promise you. Quantum theory suggests that our universe is only one of infinite parallel dimensions, some of which we exist in, others not. I used to think it was nonsense too, but waking up there, living another man's life, it all made perfect sense. Theoretically speaking, it's just possible that if the power surge occurred at precisely the moment of particle impact, then the buildup of energy in the accelerator could have sucked me into a black hole and transported me through a wormhole into a parallel universe. What happened to the other Colin? If you took the place of this other Colin, what happened to him? I don't know. If I took over his life, I would say he must have taken over mine. A straight swap. I can think of a more plausible explanation. Yes, I know that I was suffering from concussion or something. Hallucinatory states are a well-documented side effect of head trauma. It was so real, Professor. As real as this. As real as you. Mr. Trafford. Colin. Uh, Colin. You seem very sincere and and who am i to say what is or is not feasible in the rarefied field of particle physics what i am struggling to understand though and forgive me for being blunt is what what any of this has to do with me everything professor you see you were there and i was married to your granddaughter 